Hello everybody, Stallions! Handsome Jack Boy here. And today I'm bringing you guys this uh, special series I'm going to be starting here. <laughs> Claptrap. Uh, on Borderlands 1, it's just going to be me, like, you know, farming. I'm going to call it probably the Looters Live or something. Looters Live series. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to call it, but it's going to be me just, you know, farming. Farming stuff like farming Cromerax, farming secret army just doing all all sorts of cool stuff and I'll invite some sometimes I'll invite some of you guys in here and you can play with me and you know be on film so be on camera so it's gonna it's gonna be really cool uh, I don't know I just wanted to you know do something besides my guides like all my my unique guides and stuff like that I just I didn't want to just do unique guides I wanted you guys to watch me actually farm for pearlescence and just all you know farm the armory just to see what I normally do here you know cuz you don't you guys don't get to see you know what I do like farm and stuff you got you you just get to see the guide and you didn't actually get to see how I got the gun in general so this is gonna be kind of a series based on that where you get to you know see me um, get get loots and you know I'm gonna invite some of you guys in here so we can you know get some awesome loot together and yeah it's gonna be really fun so yeah let's kick this off here I'm gonna do some single player yeah for this first episode I'm just gonna do solo but I plan on you know inviting some of you guys in here for the upcoming episodes uh, I plan on doing an episode where we go through the underdome or something like the 20 rounders in the underdome or something because I haven't done those yet I I just finished doing all the the five rounds or something in, on my soldier here so as you can see I don't really have much characters I've just been working man, non-stop on my soldier you know I need to work on my other characters though I need to start the hunter too I plan on getting them to level 69 or something I might do a, a let's play here on borderlands 1 with a, with my hunter or something but anyway let's continue my soldier play through 2.5 here as you can see I left off at headstone mine because this is I this is where I left off you know I showed you guys uh, this is where I recorded recorded the gameplay for the what was it the double anarchy I believe yeah double anarchy alright so I think I have that equipped yep <laughs> anyway <clears throat> let's see what we got so this episode, we're gonna go farm Cromerax, the in the invincible Cromer hacks the invincible. <laughs> That's what I like to call him. Um, I still only have three per lesson. I also wanted to do this series uh, just because some of you guys wanted to see me actually, you know, farm for these per lesson. So yeah, we're gonna get her done. Let's see. What do I want? What do I want? What do I want? I need to pull out the Hellfire. That's what I wanted. This is my setup right here for Cromer Axe. Cromer Hacks, I mean. Cromer Gax. Just kidding. So, uh, yeah. We got this badass shield right here. We got some transfusions. This is like all I use, guys, is just transfusion. Uh, support gunner class mod. Uh, some of you guys don't know that I have a a soldier, a support soldier build video out there. Just you know, go to my channel and go to the Borderlands videos playlist, and you know, it should be there somewhere in there. It's called this. I think it's a soldier support build or something like that. Got the defiler. I call it the defiler, but you know, I'll just say defiler because I don't want you guys to like auto correct me here. Uh. Hellfire, Orion, and Unforgiven. So let's do this. Ah, fucking stuck right there. Alright. Where do we go here? We gotta go to T Bone Junction. I think I've at least farmed Cromerax 50 times or something like that. At least 50 times. And gotten 3 per lessons. 
Uh, someone on one of my friends on Steam, uh, he told me that Master Kiz farmed Gromrax thousands of times, which I do not really believe. That's you know thousands of times. That that's, that you know I'm guessing he was just saying that, but and he only got like I don't know a few per lessons or something like that. I don't know. I can't remember how many per lessons he got, but not that not that many. All right. Gotta catch a ride with your friends. Yep, it's pretty nasty. I always use the eraser just because it gets me there pretty fast. It's not that fast though, really. Just with uh, NOS, but normal speed, it's not that fast, in my opinion. I was playing with Jez the male, and uh, you know, we were farming the armory and stuff, we were driving there and, you know, I was driving, she was in the gunner seat and, <laughs> you know, I ran out of NOS, because you run out of NOS pretty quickly with this racer, and, uh, you know, we were just driving normal speed, oh jeez, that was close, we were just driving normal speed and, like, she was like, this thing's really slow, and yeah, it is really slow, normal speed, as you can see, it's not that bad. Even though it says it's pretty fast and like the loading screen tips and stuff, it's like, you know, the racer's the fastest vehicle or whatever. It's not that fast, just with the NOS. It's fun running over those Lance soldiers. But yeah, this is going to be a series. Uh, I'm not going to cancel it like I've done with my other Let's Plays. It's not really a Let's Play, it's just going to be like a series. Until I find, you know, some other videos I can make. I'm, you know, I'm kind of stuck with guides. Like, I don't really have any other plans you know, for other any other videos. Just my unique guides and pro lesson guides. So. Yeah. That's why I wanted to start this series. But yeah, I plan on getting you... Oh! Whoa. I plan on getting you guys in here too. We can uh, hook her up. Just can hook it up and uh, get her done. So gonna be an awesome series I just wanted to record me you know farming Cromrax and stuff because it's kind of getting boring just farming him so I wanted to actually get you guys in here and record it because I know you guys want to be in here you know I know you guys want to play with me so if you have steam I'll put a link in the description below so you can add me on steam um, we can uh, next time we could play co-opage in the next episode. Oh man! I also have a Steam group. I don't really use it much. I need to start using it more. It's kind of it's kind of an older Steam group now that I finished my Legendary Weapons Guide series. But it's called like, I think it's called Handsome Jack Boys Legendary Weapons Group or something. It's old, but cause, you know it was originally you know for like I don't know. <laughs> I was just, it was originally for like, I was, you know, I, was, I wanted help with this Legendary Guide series because, you know, just once, you know, when, once the uh, Legendaries got really hard to, you know, farm for, like, for example, the Reaper, once there's like, not that much Legendaries to, you know, farm for, you know, the Legendaries just get harder to find. It's hard for me to explain that right there, but, yeah, it was just kind of for that, that for that purpose. Once the legendaries got hard to farm, you know, farm for and find, you know, I just wanted your guys' help, but I never, I never used the group, so. Anyway, let's go kill Kramer Hacks. Kramer Hacks is there! <laughs> anyway, let's do this. Hopefully, hopefully I stay focused here because I'm doing a video, so I might, <laughs> I might like get carried away with the commentary and not realize what I'm actually doing in the game here. So, hopefully I stay focused. Um, I, I've actually tried live streaming, guys. Um, I did a few test videos, but it ne they never worked out. I used XSplit and I tried live streaming to YouTube, and it just you know, I did a few test videos and it didn't work out, so uh, that's why I'm just doing a live series. It's just easier to. 
And maybe I'll do some sort of Q&A or something here. Like, I don't know, like, you guys can post in the comments in this video, and then I'll answer the questions in the next video. But, no, not this time. Not this time, but I was just thinking of an idea. It's an idea. But, yeah, don't post any questions or anything. Just thinking of an idea. Alright, anyway, let's do this, peeps! Go Cromer Hacks, the Invincible. Man, I've been farming him legit, guys, okay? Okay. Like, that little corner spot that I did a video on, that's legit too, alright? Some of you guys might not think it's a legit, but it is, because I have the Borderlands 1 official strategy guide, Game of the Year Edition strategy guide. I've had it for a while, and I actually looked in there, and it showed, it, it talked about that strategy, and what am I doing just standing here? Not good. Not good. Oh, Shizzerator Apocalypse here. <laughs> I say some dumb stuff. Oh, snap. Wow. Where's my... Divider. Come on, save my ace. Kill him. Oh, oh. Throwing trans. Yeah, I really want to do... Uh, I really want to beat Cromer Hacks. Cromer Hacks. <laughs> um, I really want to beat Cromer Hacks co-op, guys. So like, once 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 I get some of you, some of you dudes in here, you can uh, do some co-opage, take them out. Cause I think it sounds fun. I've only killed them solo. I've never actually fought them co-op, which sounds really fun and easier in my opinion. But I don't know if it's easier. He's got more health, probably. Oh. Alright. Doing my uh pistol what did I call it? My <laughs> pistol trick or whatever. Uh revolver reload trick, that's what I called it. Yeah. I think I did make it up though. I think I actually did. I was think I was the first one to actually post this on our internet, the revolver reload trick. Some of you guys don't think I have, but you guys are thinking that I haven't actually like, you guys are thinking that, um, like, I don't know, like, I made it up. You're thinking that I made it up an entire gaming here or something. I don't know. You're, you're just thinking, I don't know. I, I can't really explain that, but I think I made it up just for Borderlands 1, you know? Not like... Gaming in general. Yeah, sorry if I can't explain things very well, guys. I'm just not very good at explaining some things. Oh, man. Oh, no, he's gonna kill me. But yeah, I really want to get you dudes in here so we can uh, rock out co-op. Sweet. Oh, man, he's gonna speeder you at me. Left for dead, the fun game, guys. That's what that's from. Speeder goo. Oh, or as I like to say, tweeter goo. <laughs> uh. But yeah, uh, sometimes I'll post on Twitter. You can you can follow me on there. I always post post a link to my Twitter page in the description. All my videos now. So now I have a Facebook page. So. You can also go there and like that if you want. Oh, what am I doing, guys? I don't even. I can't even think right now. Sometimes. Oh wow, he's almost dead already. Okay. Um. Sometimes it's, it's there's a weird glitch that happens with Karamarax, and I find it very interesting. Oh snap! I find it very interesting. Uh. Sometimes Karamarax will like lunge at you. It's, it's really cool, actually. But it's very scary, like, it's, it's basically what the, um, what are they, the craw maggots? Yeah, these guys right here, sometimes, watch, if, let's see if he'll do it. He'll, like, just fly at me. Right here. Look at that. That right there. Cromorax did that once, alright, to me. And I was like, what the hell is going on here? 
I was literally like so freaked out. I didn't even know what was going on. Like he's gonna die, and I was like, you know, I was all calm, and all of a sudden he just lunges at me. <laughs> Look at this double kill, double kill. Some of you dudes are like, where's Borderlands 2? You know, why aren't you playing Borderlands 2? And I'm like, I've been playing Borderlands 2, guys, alright? <laughs> I've got 500 free, 530 hours on Borderlands 2, alright? On PC, Steam. So, you can't... If you if you guys don't think I play... Whoa! If you guys don't think I play Borderlands 2, I've played plenty of Borderlands 2. I've, I've played more Borderlands 2 than Borderlands 1, alright? Especially with this new Tiny Tina's Assault and Dragon Keep DLC that came out. I've been, I've already finished the DLC. And it's, it was a blast. But uh, the reason being, I haven't been posting much Borderlands 2 videos is because, uh, you know, there's just been there's a lot of other a lot of other guys out there that, you know, already do that. Like they already, you know, post a lot of you know Borderlands 2 videos. Like Yodi Slayer, for example. You know, he already does that. So I, I don't know if I, you know, I'm going to do Borderlands 2 videos eventually, alright, after I'm almo almost done with Borderlands 1 or something, after I can't really do much, you know, much more with Borderlands 1, I'm going to do Borderlands 2, but, alright, let's focus on Crime Racks here, just can't seem to pull out the right weapons here, sometimes you can shoot through them and like hit the freaking hit the uh, who's... Claw. Uh, you can. Oh man, I need it. Get out of here! Ah, uh, stay away from me, you freak! I haven't tried out the new uh, raid bosses on Borderlands 2. The assault, assault on try, uh, assault on Dragon Keep DLC. I haven't tried out the new raid boss or whatever. Um, yesterday though, last night I mean, Yodi, me and Yodi played some Borderlands 2, it was freaking amazing, <laughs> and uh, we tried to get the new, we tried to get the Lord of Orcs to spawn or whatever, to level up into the, the Orc Warlord or something to level up into the Lord of Orcs via the new Magic Slaughter or whatever, and it didn't work out, but I wish it would've, I hope we do it again. We might actually go through it again today or something. It'd be really based. <laughs> so yeah, probably next the next episode of this series, uh, I'll probably get some of you dudes in here. We can rock out co-op each year. Kill some trauma hacks. Oh wow. Alright, I just need to freaking finish off this dude. Trauma hacks here. I need to finish him off. Come on. Come on. She is a raider. Oh. <laughs> Hurry. Oh, snapper. Ew. Don't hunt me. <laughs> He's like humping me. Sick. The revolver reload trick's really good with uh, the filer. But yes, you know, in in my uh, Whitting's elephant gun guide, where I talked about talked about the uh, revolver reload trick. You know, I was just talking about Borderlands 1. I wasn't talking about ga all of gaming in general, you know. I was just talking about Borderlands 1. I made it up for just Borderlands 1. That's what I was trying to explain. You know? Like, not just freaking gaming in general, you know. I didn't... <laughs> I know I didn't, you know, like other games, like, for example, Call of Duty, you know. People are thinking... I made it up in all these other games, but I just... I'm just saying I made it up in Borderlands 1, alright? Because you can't really do this kind of thing in some other games, you know. And I know there's this other dude that said, he's like, he called it, 
you know, reload canceling. I, I know it's not called reload canceling. I know what reload canceling is. He's like, you didn't make it up. It's called reload canceling or something like that. And I know it's not. Oh my gosh. I just need to kill this guy. I'm just getting so involved with this commentator here that. I can't even. Oh man. <laughs> oh, I just need to finish off Cromer Axe. No, come back here. Go down my century. Century. Scorpio, whatever it is. Eh? Oh. What was I saying? Oh yeah, there's a... A dude that said... That it, it was called the load cancelling, and I'm like... Dude... I know what reload canceling is. It's not reload canceling. I mean, reload canceling's like, like you know, <laughs> like on Call of Duty or something. Like you shoot, and then you reload, and then when your clip is full, like it will like your clip will go full. Like for example, with a heavy machine gun, like I don't know how to explain this, but you know, you for example, you're reloading a heavy machine gun and. You know, you're not done reloading it, and all, you see your clip go full. You know, you're like you're done reloading, but you're still re doing the reloading animation, and you can like sprint, and then it will stop that, and you know, it's a, like a faster way to reload. That's that's what I'm trying to say. That's that's reload canceling or something like that. I'm not sure if that's reload canceling, but I know what reload canceling is, and I know my revolver reload trick is not even close to reload canceling. All right, I know what it is. Oh man. Okay, we need to finish off Craw her hacks. <laughs> I'll be pretty stupid in these videos, alright guys. Cause I am a retard. Can... Alright. I don't know why, but I can't even hit his critical hit spot. I don't know why, it's weird. Alright, there we go. Oh! It should just penetrate through his freaking... Come on. Stay away from me. Wait a second. Like, it's calm music. Is it normally like this? I thought it was always like... Because it was just like action music of a minute ago, and now it's like calm. Okay, that's just freaky. Feels like... Maybe because we've been in here so long. <laughs> hey, at least I've been surviving, you know? Staying alive. Been going down! <gasps> Perfect time! Oh, wow. But I've killed him legit a lot of times, too, guys. And that corner spot is legit. It says, even says in the freaking official strategy guide, you know, it, it talks about that corner glitch in there. Which I found out the corner glitch actually doesn't work all the time, right? So if you guys like actually try the glitch and you keep getting killed from him, it's it doesn't work all the time. Only sometimes. Like that's why I've been killing him this way because it doesn't work for me now. For some reason. Just sometimes. Sometimes I'll try it once in a great while, but now I just kill him this way. I don't really have a you know a strategy for doing it this way. You know, um, I just run around the arena. I don't go through the middle or anything. I just keep running around non-stop. You know, throw transfusions and all sorts of stuff like that. Ah, I keep missing my opportunity. I need to somehow hit him with this. Oh no! Don't keep me trapped. <clears throat> but yeah, this isn't a let's play or anything. This might turn into a let's play, but it's just it's gonna be called Looters Live or something. It's just gonna be a series of me just farming stuff, like farming Cromer hacks and the armory and going through the Underdome 20 rounds. Because I know those are long, it would be perfect for the series. But I wanna do the 20 rounds with subs, I don't wanna go through it solo. I might go through one solo, but I think it would be kinda of boring. I think I wanna actually go through the subs and like communicate with each other, like through mics. Through the phone, actually. I know a lot of you guys don't like the Underdome, but I love the Underdome. It's one of my favorite DLCs. Some of you might think it's boring and it's, you know, not even like Borderlands 
style. You know, it's just... You know, there's not really any loot you can get. I know, it, it is different. It's something... But I, I'm glad they introduced it into Borderlands because even though it's... I don't know. It's not really... Like, Borderlands style. It's not really, like, fit for Borderlands. You know, if you guys understand what I'm saying. It's not really fit for Borderlands. That kind of arena style thing, in my opinion. Because, well, the Underdome, but... Not like the circle of slaughter or anything. I'm saying the underdome. Because they, what they should have done is they should have freaking made you gain it XP and stuff. You know, like and been more loot and stuff. Because that's why it's it's not that popular. Is probably because there's not not much loot. That's what I'm saying. It's it's not really fit for Borderlands. You know, they should have changed it up. If they would have put XP and you know, more guns and stuff. I know you get guns from, like, every round or whatever. There's guns that drop in the middle. Um, and some, I've gotten a few, a couple legendaries from that, but. Oh, yeah, there we go. Come on, pearlescent. But, yeah, they should have, if they would have put XP and, gun, you know, loot and stuff, then it would have been more fit for Borderlands, you know. It just would have been more fun. And, I mean, I still enjoy it. Oh, yeah, Equalizer. Firehawk. I don't really pick up these legendaries. Ooh, wow. Whoa, guys. Wow. Explosive Wildcat? I didn't know the Wildcat had any elements. Ooh, I'm actually going to try this. I don't really... Wait a second here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on a second. What? Alright guys, I didn't know the Wildcat, because I've only tried the Wildcat once, like, just, you know, in my guide, and my version, I thought all versions had that weird, like, ricochet effect that, you know, the twirly bullets or whatever, that ricochet, and, you know, I, I thought so, and I guess not, I, so this one is explosive and it doesn't have that effect, because... That's why I didn't like the wild cause I, cat, because I thought it had like the twirly bullets and stuff, but I guess not. So that's beast, alright? This is, this is beast, guys. I think I'm gonna start using this more. This is freaking beast though, times three explosive wildcat. This is, this is nice. I mean, ooh, pearl havoc. Okay, see any pearl essence? Please be a pearl essence. That would be freaking amazing. I don't see any. Pearls shouldn't be that rare. I mean, I've gotten three pearls and I farmed them 50 times. That's not bad, alright? The first time, the first, you know, 10 times I was farming them, though, that's when I got, you know, most of the pearl essence was like, I probably got two t the first 10 times farming them or something. Once I saw a pearl, when he, like, died and all the loot flies up in the air, I was actually, whoa, shooting star. I, s <laughs> I saw a pearl essence, like, I was like, hey! It was the, the rose or whatever. The rose shield. But if you guys don't know, I actually... Um, I actually have all my legendaries stored. Like, I have... I still have all my all the legendaries in the game right now. I have every single one. I, I didn't throw any away. Because I actually started this legendary guide series when I was like level 40-something. On my Roland. You know, on my uh, soldier here. And... I actually, you know, I leveled up, you know, I went through playthrough 2, leveled up, and I had to drop those legendaries, and I, you know, I found them all again, and I have every single legendary. I have some stored in my bank. I'll have to show you guys. Uh, I have some stored in my bank. I have some in my inventory right now. And, yeah. Uh, I really still want to find... You know, my own version of these Iridium Legendaries. They're really cool in my opinion. I think these were modded. I, you know, I was, I was given these by someone. Can't remember who. The guy that gave me these, I think it was Serial Bandits. He, he didn't mod them. I know he didn't mod them, but I think, you know, someone else before that gave them to him. And they were modded or something. But they're still legit, though. They're still, like, legit. Although, I, you can just kind of tell they're modded because they're level 69 each and every one of them. They're all, like, the lowest legendary color, which is the yellow. You know, because 
the more darker the orange or whatever in a legendary like the color the more like better it is the more rare and better so as you can see these are like really dark this is like the best you can go right here all these and then these are so it gets lighter the more lighter the less powerful and stuff you know see right here the rose I really wanna I really wanna get some more of those pearl shields guys because I think they're really unique like there's no legendary shields in Borderlands 1 but there's pearl shields so that that's really cool uh, yeah I don't see it I don't see a pearl guys Boo! I say we farm them maybe once or twice and then I'm gonna wrap this episode up but this time I'm gonna kill them faster <laughs> I'm, I'm, not, I'm not gonna get wrapped up in the gun theory I was just trying to explain a few things I'm sorry if I didn't explain, you know, some some of the things I you know, was talking about very well. I just sometimes I can't explain very well, so yeah. And I'm not very used to this, you know, live commentary stuff. But I'm gonna get used to it. I'm gonna definitely get used to it. You know. And I plan on doing more let's plays. All right, guys. I, you know, I'm not done with let's plays. Like. This series might turn into some sort of Borderlands 1 Let's Play. You know, it might be the same series, too. Like, it, it's just going to be a Let's Play, though, or something. Like, I might do this Let's Play, and then sometimes I'll go back to and farm on my character. It's just going to be... You know, you're going to... You guys are going to watch me, basically, what I actually do in Borderlands 1. You know, my... You actually get experience behind-the-scenes action here. On what I do. Like, what I... You know, farm and all the stuff I get. Experience it first. Alright, so yeah, I don't see anything, guys. I just see legendaries, which I don't care about here. Wait, hold on. Although this wildcat is really beast, alright, guys? It's pretty good fire, it, too. I'm in love with this thing. Freaking times three explosive, that's beast! Freaking beast. Um, I really want to find, because you can actually get... Is that You know, I have the... As you can see, I have a... You know, Unforgiven with a master barrel on it. And you can actually get... Uh, you know other legendary revolvers with a masher barrel on them, which is awesome. Like one of my friends on Steam, uh, his name's Creed the Psycho on Steam. I don't know what it's, you know. He's he has YouTube too. He's he's a fan of mine. He added me like a, a day or two ago or something like that. And I think it was him. I'm not sure if it was him, but he said it was. It might have been someone else. I can't remember, but he it was either him or someone else. He said that like. Uh, that he had like an anaconda legendary revolver with a master barrel on it and he had um I, what was the other one? Oh man I just thought of that guys <gasps> a defiler with a masher barrel on it right now that'd be sick oh my gosh is that possible post in the comments below guys if that's possible and he had like an equalizer with a masher barrel on it which is that my have is that a masher barrel? No. Uh. I'm not sure if there's a master barrel. But, oh my gosh, guys. The filer with a master barrel. That would be, like, one of the best things ever. Best thing ever. Alright, so, yeah. I don't see a pearl. If, if I actually pass a pearl, and you guys, like, see me pass a pearl here, post in the comments, because... You know, I'd like to know if I actually miss a pearl. So be on the lookout just in case I actually miss one here. Because that, that'd be funny. If you guys actually see a pearl and post in the comments, I'd be like, oh my effing. I would literally, like, rage quit right there. I'd probably, like. Because <laughs> if it. Especially if it's a pearl that I don't even have. That would. That would suck. That'd suck. Oh wow, they're right there. I sounded like Yodi Slayer. And to, to you guys that think I'm actually trying to copy Yodi Slayer, you're freaking wrong, alright? I don't even try to act like Yodi Slayer, alright? I was inspired by him, you know? I might say a few things, you know, that he says, like, Peace, you know? I might have got that from him, but that's basically it, you know? Like, I never... I'm not trying to copy him, alright? This is my... This is actually how I, you know, talk, and... I'm not trying to copy anybody, dudes. You know, I got inspired from him. You know, 
I might kind of act like him, but that's just because I was inspired by him. I mean, I, I watch a lot of his videos, that might be why, but I'm not actually trying to copy him. There was this dude that was like too much Yodi Slayer copying. I, and he said he was a fan, but still, dude, don't don't post that. If you're if you're sub and you like my videos, don't post that kind of stuff, alright? Anyway, I'm just like rambling on here. <laughs> Anyway, that was that was awesome, guys. So, um, if you dudes haven't watched my cr how to uh, farm Cromerax video or whatever, how to defeat Cromerax Invincible Solo video, uh, I'll post the link in the description below, and probably post the link in the video right now. Um, like at this point, there'll probably be a link. Anyway, is there? Let's, we, let's, uh, I don't know. Let's not check those. I'll probably post the link or something in the video right now and uh like and uh, in the description or something so you guys can go check that out if you haven't and I'll post a link in the description below if that takes you to my Roland support build because a lot of you guys are like you should do a build on your soldier and I already have dudes you just gotta go to my channel and you know look in the Borderlands playlist because I got a lot of cool videos that you might ha not have seen in that playlist in the Borderlands playlist just all these like miscellaneous Borderlands videos, like for example, how to farm uh, the, the Crimson Armory, or how to level up, hello, how to level up your Iridian, I mean <laughs> Iridian, how to level up your weapon proficiencies faster, or yeah, just stuff like that. You know, how to kill Cromax Invincible Solo, stuff like that. You can also learn from this video as well because this is kind of my newer, up-to-date strategy. On how to kill Cromrax, I might do another video sometime, but I probably won't do another video on how to kill Cromrax <laughs> solo. Because I know a lot of you dudes still farm Cromrax, the invincible. All right, I better pull out. What did I? All right, the Defender. But yeah, I, I still play. I, I play a lot of Borderlands too. All right, guys. I, I play a lot more Borderlands two than I play Borderlands one. But I'm pretty sure. Cause like before I did this, um, before I actually started, you know, my videos and stuff, making videos, I didn't have that much, you know, hours on Borderlands one at all. I wasn't, you know, when I started the series, I was level 45, and that that was my only character, and I wasn't even on playthrough two, playthrough. I haven't even started playthrough two yet, so. Well, when I was, you know, when I started the series, when I started the uh, Legendary Weapon Guide series for Borderlands 1, I was only like, you know, level 40-something on my Roland, and you could go back, guys, and actually watch that video and let me know what level I was, or something, or I might check it out. I actually kind of want to watch my Legendary Guide series again. My first Legendary Guides were, um, alright, here we go, we're going to go kill Crimer Hacks, but anyway... Uh, my first, like, legendary weapon guides weren't that good, like, commentary-wise. I mean, they were still guide. All my, you know, guides are a guide, you know? Like, they, they teach you about with a weapon, and I show off gameplay. So, like, if you were, you know, happen to find that gun in the game, you know, you, like, and if you watched my guide, you'd actually know what it does, and, you know, you know, you know how to use it effectively. <laughs> I, I don't really plan on going to another place in the game, like, to, you know, show off gameplay. Like, right now I'm showing off gameplay in the, uh, oh crap. No! 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 Oh. I said right now, um, I don't really have, you know, plans to go to another area, you know, to show off gameplay. Oh. For like guns, you know, for guides. I don't really plan on. All right, guys, I can't even speak right now. They're just chasing me for days here. But yeah, I don't plan on like, you know. Oh my freaking heck! Can't even speak. <laughs> Cause you know, right now I'm like in my guides. You know, I I always show off gameplay at Headstone Mine. I don't plan on changing that up for probably a long time. I don't even know if I'm going to change that out. I might actually go back to the Underdome once in a while to show off some gameplay or something. 
but it, it's probably just gonna stay at stone mine. It, if it's a corrosive gun, I'll probably go to like Old Haven and kill some lions or something. Cause I, there's just that's that's the really the only the best place I think in the game to actually show off gameplay. It's just so easy. You just go fast travel there and ban. There's ban. It's right in your face, dude. So. I, I find that the best place to actually show off gameplay. So if you guys actually plan on doing some sort of like series or something to show off gameplay of guns, then I, I say you, you go to Headstone Mine because that's a really good place. I mean, at first, and you know, through most of my legendary weapon guides, I actually was going through the uh, Underdome. And, uh. Oh, crap. I can't even hit this freak. I freaking suck, guys. The rover reload trick. Anyway, what was I saying? About hit some of mine. Oh yeah, uh come on, hit his back spot. Come on. Oh my gosh. Did you see that guys? I have a freaking shotgun revolver and none of like only like one of those you know hit his back spot. That was that sucked. One of the freaking bullet points like, hit his back spot. I have a freaking I have a freaking shotgun revolver and like none of them hit his spot. That's how bad I am. Aiming. Bam, there we go. But yeah, I don't plan on actually showing off gameplay anywhere else besides SD9. I mean, I used to, you know, like I said, I used to go to the Underdome a lot, but I don't know. The Underdome's a good place to show gameplay as well, but I I don't know. Headstone Mine's the easiest place, in my opinion. I mean. But yeah, I plan on also doing a, you know, eventually doing a Q&A or something in this series. Oh, crap. This series is going to be a little slow. It's not going to be like really fast but if I don't for example I don't want to make a guide or something I'll probably just continue this series because I'm just <laughs> I'm just kind of sick of just doing guides all the time you know I wanted to do something different that's why I wanted to start this oh my gosh and some of you guys you know want to know what I actually do oh crap you know some of you guys want to watch me farm like Cromer Axe for example Cromer Hacks some of you guys want to watch me farm him say what for me I want to see Cromer hacks and Warren at me like that. <laughs> so awesome, guys. It was very scary, but really awesome. I just thought that was so interesting. I even looked on the wiki, but there was actually nothing on it on the wiki, which is really amazing, in my opinion. I should, like, go on there first or something about it. <laughs> but yeah, I really want to get you dudes in here and we can play co-op, because I really want to go through the Underdome. Like, I want to get Jez DeMille in here. You know, I hope she levels up, because she's not level 69, and uh, I hope she I hope she levels up and gets there before I actually do that video. But yeah, like me on Facebook. You know, I'll have a link. In, I always have a link in the description below. You know, you, so you can just get, you know like me on Facebook if you want. Follow me on Twitter. I need to start doing more stuff on like Twitter and stuff. I mean, I'm always on Twitter, but I don't, like, actually post very much. I don't really, you know, up post my status or anything. I mean, I, I post, you know, like, for example, I post about, like, a video that's uploading or something. Or, like, uh, you know, rendering or something. I always post about that, usually, beforehand, just to let you guys know, so you can actually be one of the first to watch the video. Oh, man. Wait, whoa, 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 oh, okay. He died from corrosive damage, so I'm like, how did I, how the heck did I get back up? That was pretty crazy. Alright, let's, let's focus on Cromer Axe here. Oh my gosh, minion, get into me. Hey, is it? No, I don't think it's smash, bro. Oh my gosh, this headset is hurting my freaking head so bad. Alright. But yeah, if I actually pass up, like a per lesson or something, guys, and I don't, you know, and you you watch the video, and just let me know in the comments below, because I would like to know. Um, what was I going to do? I was going to pull out. What did I have out? The... I'm forgetting. Long and strong. Ah, I just sometimes it's so hard to you know find any like 
find pearlescence in this huge pile of blues and stuff, you know, blues and purples. It's very difficult. Come on. I hope we find a pearl. You know, I'm this is not, you know, I'm going to do more episodes on Cromer hacks, guys. Like this is not you know, the only episode I'm going to farm Cromer hacks, you know. I'm going to do more episodes, like especially, you know, like I said, I was, you know, I'm going to do do an episode with you guys in here. So, you know, I'm going to I'm going to do many episodes with me farming Cromer hacks. But I want to do most of them with with you guys because I just think it sounds so much fun to have you guys in here too, you know. Sounds so much fun. S you know, solo is getting boring. I've been, you know, doing ooh, pearl repeater, huh? Uh, uh, uh. But it, yeah, it's just getting so boring doing solo because that's all I've been doing. Ooh, hunter shotgun. I thought I thought that was a legendary or whatever. The what was it? The hunter or something? The striker. The striker. It's kind of like that. <clears throat> all right, guys. I think I'm gonna wrap it up here. I'm just gonna go down and hit that save point or whatever. Ugh. Uh, I don't see anything. But post in the comments if I actually pass per lesson. <laughs> if you see one. I don't think I did. I don't see anything. But it's really hard to, you know, tell. I almost passed one. You know, in my, in my, um, if you guys have watched it, uh, the, you know, Cromerax video, I can't even remember the name right now. My head hurts so bad. Uh, you know how to finish, how to beat Cromerack solo, whatever. You know, I I find a pearl lesson there. I almost missed it. I like came back up and I saw it and I recorded. It was an amazing moment. I literally like <laughs> happy quitted or whatever. I don't know how to explain that. Instead of rage, the opposite of rage quit. I just. I literally like got up and I was like screaming for days, but screaming enjoy. But anyway, guys, that was really fun first episode of my Looters Live. I'm just gonna call it Looters Live. I don't know. It's kind of a cool name, Looters Live. I don't know if that's a really cool name. If you have an you know other you know another suggestion for you know another name. If you have a, if you have a suggestion for another name uh, or something, an idea, then post in the comments, guys, because I don't know if Looters Live is the best name, you know, for this series, but I think it's a cool name, Looters Live. You know, I'm a looter, so <laughs> it kind of sounds weird, but I'm a looter and I'm doing this live, so and then you guys are gonna be looters as well, so it's gonna be really awesome. You know, the rest of the series, I can't wait. I mean, this was a really fun first episode. I had a lot of fun, even though like I was like, failing for days. It seemed like a lot of fun. Nasty Raptor. But yeah, let's hit this checkpoint over here. Um, I don't know what I'll do next episode. I don't really know yet. I might farm more Cromrax or something. But I plan on getting you guys in here, if possible. So add me on Steam. I'll post a link in the description below. You can add me on Steam. I don't really want too many friends on Steam. I'm trying to keep it clean. So, yeah, once it gets past a certain limit, I might start deleting friends. But, you know, if I delete you by accident, you know, if I delete you, then, you know, and if you're a good friend, then add me, you know, let me know and add me back. But if I delete you, I'm very, I'm very sorry. You know, if you're a sub, I'm very sorry. But I'm just trying to keep my friends list on Steam clean. I, I used to have like 90 something friends almost. Actually I used to have 100 friends and now I have like 60 something or something now. I used to have like I cleaned up I had 50 and now I have 60 or something. Um, but yeah that's basically it guys. I uh, had a lot of fun. I hopefully hopefully get you guys in here. Uh, I hope to get you guys in here in upcoming episodes but yeah I had a lot of fun. We didn't get no pearlescence, but that's fine. Uh, so yeah, that's basically it, guys. I'm out of here. Peace!